hey guys welcome to another video so this video is won't start with the normal intro cause i'm not talking about any bl couple or artist or actor i'm talking about gl we've shifted to gl so apparently this week started with a lot of problems like idol factory that represent sarocha chan kim ha i think i'm sorry if i'm butchering your name also known as friend came out and made that first of all they posted a photo of i think two girls or women who were outside i think friend's apartment taking photos and videos and they said that these people who are invading her privacy and they were following her every time she goes into a house they knew all her schedule they were taking pictures of people that were getting into her apartment it was a whole mess and unfortunately the wrong thing that they did first was they put some emojis on these people's faces which i don't think was right because if you're going to put someone on blast and they're doing the, the wrong thing and you're already taking legal actions against them, you should be able to post their faces. So these people allegedly did all that to friend and Idol Factory was not there for it. So they put out a statement and said fans should stop going to that extreme and they should wait for schedules that have been put up to see their their favorites their idols their celebrities so that's it push back to yesterday they also put out another statement again idol factory condemning those those what those problems again how far fans go to to invade their artists privacy but unfortunately i was following the story but i don't deal with gls so i was 50 50 on whether to put up the story or to not put up the story but because there was little to no information about everything the faces were covered like no one knew what to go into so i just let it go i said okay let me just let it go it's nothing it's it's nothing i can i can't put up a one minute video just showing two photos so i let it go and then today i wake up and then i see seng also posted that fans had invaded his privacy and fans should stop and legal action will be taken and I actually said okay it's like everyone is invading anyone's privacy nowadays so these two things can't be related it didn't cross my mind that it can be related fast forward to like a few minutes ago i see this video of seng and friend and if you know seng seng with chai He's he he has been on BLs. He was partnered up with Billy, and then unfortunately he didn't he didn't whatever he didn't renew his contract with his company. So he left, and like that was the end of Billy because Billy is now paired up with someone else, and the BL will be coming out I think this year. And I actually forgot about him. And then now a video comes out of him and friend kissing and fans are pissed pissed because like there's some fans saying that friend had like come out uh like in a certain live and said that she had a boyfriend and then like people made her take back her words i'm going to insert the video here and then 
it was like like it's a lot of information guys so most probably i'm i will try to put it here but i think i will put everything together when the video is about to end because it's a lot of information i'll try to insert the pictures but for the videos you'll have to wait until almost the end of the video and then like there were certain people that were also trying to push this like friend becky like they were trying to push it that it was real which it wasn't because that video allegedly ain't a fake I've watched it and I don't think in my opinion I don't think it's a fake the way I've the way I've watched it although it has it has only only bits and bits of of parts have come out and I think alleged I have read that allegedly there is a 10 minute video so I'm waiting on that if I get that, it will also be included in this video. If I don't get it, I'm sorry. I'll post a part two when I get the 10 minute video. And it's the whole 10 minute video. You best believe I'm going to put it on my channel. And then there is now a couple of photos that have been coming out and statements between friend and friend Becky and and saying which I whereby people are now connecting the dots that they were actually throwing out signs that people were like neglecting to see or to read or to understand and to comprehend and it's a whole mess and then you know like I think a few months back there was some rumors about Becky and what's his name Nat of Max Nat, the ones that are doing Naughty the series, the ones that are signed to the, the that Nat, I think his name is Nat, is signed to the whatever, Dumondi or the agency that Zip, Zipruk and Nuniwi, Nuniu, I'm sorry if I'm butchering that name, Aaron. So there were those rumors, I saw them and I totally believed them, but the story died down. So I was like, oh, maybe I'm wrong. I'm too trusting and too believing. So I let that shit go. But now there's a picture of them on a double date with someone else who was there. I think it was that that person was there to fool people to not think it was a double date. Like, it was just friends meeting up. I don't know the name of the person, so I'm sorry. I don't know who that person is, but it's definitely friends saying and Becky and Nat. And then there's also pictures of when Becky was sick. Like, I think she was on the phone with no when friend was sick i think she was on the phone with becky and like there is like a first time phone call and sang posted a picture i think around the same time and sang was on a bed that kind of looks the same kind of looks the same as the one friend was on allegedly i don't know as i said there's not only one thing that it's sold on a store that only one person has to buy there are multiple co same color same design of things so i'll go with allegedly because i don't do that shit of trying to say okay this one is with this one so it's probably this one's thing okay so that and then the same time that Fine was sick, Seng was supposed to be like on, I think, a fan meeting in China that he cancelled, apparently, allegedly, to be by friend's side. So I'm going to include all those tweets of people. You know me, I work with screenshots. So everything I'm going on, 
I have screenshot to back that she up. So they're going to be here. So that's what what is going on. So like fans are divided. Some people are all standing by friend and saying it's no problem that she has a boyfriend, but she would have said it abstract that she will she has a boyfriend. And they're still going to support her regardless. Some other ones are saying it's a deep fake. They don't believe that shit. So people should just move forward. Other people now are cursing Idol Factory for not saying anything. And it's been like all this shit started coming out since last night. So on the 28th, because I'm working on a different time zone, maybe with someone else. So... It's now morning here where I am. And Idol Factory didn't say she about it. They only put out that statement and didn't actually say why they were putting up that statement. So I think this person that has this account had already started posting those photos and videos. That's why Idol Factory quickly hurriedly put out their statement. And Seng also put out his statement at the same time. Like, this is funny. And I'm saying that... <laughs> I'm laughing because I'm saying that finally, you know, like, this industry, that the BL industry and the GL industry right now, that it's emerging, the GL industry, like, fans, like get so delusional that they believe that these people are actually these people that work together actually dead and then they spend lots of money and their time and everything time it's not wrong because if you want to see someone that you love and you can be able to afford it you go and see them but i say that people should draw a line like if you if this celebrity of yours has a product that they're endorsing or they have something of their own that they're selling by all means buy that shit buy the product because you're going to use it you're going to put it to good use but taking out your hard earned cash money and giving them to them that's enough for me like just money that's enough for me also the with the food whatever the food feeding program the food trucks and i'm also not for that yeah i know it 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 will take like a long time to film the shows and everything but i believe those people can still eat they can still afford their meals that's why i think i love i don't know if it was John Cook or someone from BTS who said, please don't send me food. I can buy my own food. I can eat. I think this art, BL artist uh, actors and these actors in general should also start doing this. They should stop their fans from donating money for them to be bought for food and they are, act, they are really it's not like they're going to starve. They are going to eat. They have the means to feed themselves. So that's it for me. That's what makes fans get angry when they support these actors and then they hear things that they have been hiding or they have been perpetrating. So this video is getting too long. I'll do another part two on my thoughts on fans buying spending giving giving these actors their money and the fan surface thing but here i am saying last last now everybody go chop breakfast no one is safe for everyone is going to chop breakfast like all these fandoms like all of them are fake they just acting those people they just perpetrating fan service and they're just getting their way into your pockets so please subscribe like comment turn on the post notifications and i'll see you in my next video be ready part two is definitely coming so bye guys
Philippine girlfriend is a boy. It's a boy. I don't know who it is, but I know he's a boy. Oh, I don't know his name, but but he's a boy. Queen, uh, is a boy. Have boyfriend? Yes. Yes. Emily Baker is not friend girlfriend. No, it's just in it's just in a it's just in a, a, a movie. Actually, uh, a best friend.